In this intermediate end cloth course, I'm going to show how to convert your clothing rigs into end cloth driven clothing. This is the character I will be using for this course. Her clothing was sculpted in ZBrush and textured in Substance Painter. The clothing rely on displacement, base color, and roughness texture maps in UDIM format. I created the character rig last year, and after animating her and dealing with a lot of crashes, I decided to optimize the rig. One of the main plans for optimization is to discard the skinning, constraints and ribbon driven control systems, the formers, and some of the blend shapes that the clothing rely on for functionality. This will make the rig a lot faster and obviously eliminate the need to animate the clothing by hand. I may still have to do some fine tuning of the simulated result with the end cloth properties or Maya deformers, but it will still be considerably less work than animating the clothing from scratch with the rig. So the intended workflow is to be able to animate the character with the clothing hidden and the end cloth system deactivated and then simulate the clothing once the animation is polished. In the next lesson, I will start stripping most of the clothing's current control system in preparation for the end cloth system.